This is the microbe wall at the KU Natural History Museum. In each of these petri dishes coming from different settings and environments, you'll see different types of textures and colors that make these funky designs that you see. Now, the museum creates these by putting agar, an antibiotic, into a clean petri dish. The antibiotic prevents overgrowth and the agar is more of a food source for the fungi to feed off of. Fungi can have varying shapes, like they can have a circular, irregular, or filamentous form. Margins can vary as well, ranging from an entire structure to undulated, filiform, curled, and lobate structures. Or they can vary in elevation, like have a raised, convex, flat, umbonate, or craterform shape as well. If you see something fuzzy or moldy, molds are fungi. They can vary in color and shape and texture. Now, we're gonna be looking at this refrigerator door handle where we took a swab of it and then put that swab sample into a petri dish to grow the fungi. The changes you're going to see occurred over the course of three and a half weeks. The day of each petri dish image is labeled on the bottom left-hand corner of each image. We decided to take a sample from a TV remote as well, and then put that sample in a petri dish to grow for three and a half weeks. We're gonna show you the results of that experiment. Make sure you know what changes you see.